Hi you guys, thank you so much for clicking on another video of mine. I'm trying to find the time to record videos that just go smoothly and quality is not super terrible. So now is the time for me. I look a little bit of mess, but now is the time for me. So batch recording, I think it's called. Um, I just filmed my June empties. Now I'm going to show you guys some layering combos. So if you want to stick around and see what I've been layering this past week, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and keep watching. All right, you guys. So you know I love to layer and I love my little collection that I got going on. And I just feel like adding body mist into your collection, even if it's really like not your thing, I feel like having a few body mist just really helps to accentuate your scent, allow you to play with different scent profiles you can just have fun and really make a scent really hit for yourself you know so that's what i've been doing i've been in my collection just pairing things and i want to share some of them with you guys i love sharing them so i'll start off with this one so i reached for pinkberry clouds recently because this one is in my summer project use it up this smells so good right now I know it's not some people's favorite because of that fresh air note, but I feel like the fresh air note is almost like really giving a nice touch and vibing with the summer fresh air season. It's like a nice strawberry. The strawberry is so sweet, but it's also like just fruity for the summer. It's giving me like fruity summer. So I consider this a summer gourmand. If you see this video, don't forget to like keep up with my shorts as well. I want to start posting more of those. I'm going to post my summer gourmands in a short. So this one's going to be in there. So I reached for this recently. I'm going to spray it right now, honestly. It smells so good. So this one has strawberry sponge sugar, marshmallow fluff, and fresh air. And it's so good for the fall, so good for the winter when it like comes out, but I feel like it's really, really giving me the vibes right now. Like I feel like everybody uses cotton candy clouds and that one is like super sugary sweet. So I feel like this one is super sugary sweet as well. It's working for me for the summer. Um, and usually I would pair a scent like this with another perfume that I have here, the viva la juicy la fleur perfume because that one is so heavy on the red berries and the sweetness um so i do usually pair these super sweet cotton candy scents with that perfume this time i reached for something different i reached for my burberry brit you guys and i don't know why it's like a fall winter scent as well um but it's perfect for all year round and with the lime in here i feel like it gives it a nice citrusy my favorite word vibe <laughs> citrusy vibe for the summer this one might sound weird to you guys but again layering is just your prerogative and what you like and this one was doing it for me like i feel like so what was going on here was this one has vanilla and tonka bean and stuff in the base so you can consider it like a vanilla scent and then that's gonna vibe with the marshmallow in here and then i feel like the lime and the sugar was really like working with the strawberry because if you know pink watermelon blast has lime and strawberry as well so i just feel like that can be my only way of thinking like why this smelled good for me for a nice daytime summer little like just chilling vibe always with my children so we're like running to the park running to get a donut running to get a slushy like this is just like a nice super sweet vibe this one was really really nice to smell i really really enjoyed it i did throw something in the mix but i would consider this the main layering combo again it was burberry brit with pink berry cloud so i have another sugary sweet vibe going on um i did show this one in my recent short this one is using sun blooms and suede which is in my top 10 summer fragrance mist picks for the summer this one has white raspberry pink petals and vanilla cream 
and I have been loving this and I slept on this you guys like I paid zero attention to like this indigo dreams cloud nine when they first dropped but as the months went on I just kept seeing this one online and I was like I feel like that one's calling my name like I know it's gonna be light I know it's gonna be airy I know I knew it was gonna be a light scent but something about the notes like that vanilla cream with the pink petals and white raspberry like I just was like what is that white raspberry gonna be like smelling like like I need that I knew it was gonna give me like bougie on a budget vibes <laughs> I just knew it and it does and it just lifts my mood like it just smells like the ultimate shower you're in the ultimate mood you're feeling good you're feeling sexy you're feeling high vibrational like it, it's it's bougie like you just it just puts you in that mindset like you are not I am not where I am right now I am my ultimate self like it just smells so good I love this one um this is another one I feel like I'll kind of mix and match with like a lot of different things but I love this I love it what I would describe this as even though they're not the same but since I have that here and it I recently smelled it and like I can give you guys like what I feel like it kind of smells like I feel like this is a summer version of fall and bloom so that one has like plum and moss and it's kind of like airy plummy this one's like airy white raspberry with the vanilla cream it's like a summer version of fall and bloom I wouldn't say it either of the two are better than the other like I just kind of feel like this is a airy type of sweet scent perfect for the summer so i used this one and then i used the pure seduction heat from victoria's secret which is also raspberry it's sparkling raspberry and sun-kissed hibiscus so this one is of course perfect for summer um but a hibiscus note isn't my favorite note Although I do really like this scent, the sparkling raspberry saves it, it is so juicy and this one is really really good and it's super sexy, it's super luscious and yummy but it's like, it's just like, it's so good but it's not my favorite, I don't know why so that was a lovely scent and then like I said I do have the Viva Le Juicy Le Fleur here and this one is like all the notes that Viva Le Juicy has the honeysuckle so all that jazz but this one is so specific on the red berries like it literally smells so juicy dripping of like red raspberries and strawberries and super super juicy sweet feminine vibes um so that was a lovely summer combo this is like a great all year round type of scent but yeah for the summer this was hitting but not gonna lie you guys when i first did this combo here when i first did this combo before i even did the pure seduction heat you guys that was a totally different day when i first did this combo i reached for my pure seduction lux you guys not heat lux i love this one you guys this one is again on the fall and bloom type of vibe it's a airy sweet pink scent like it's so good i don't know i fell in love with this one the violet is like a note i wouldn't think i would enjoy as much as i do but i really like this one I love it in the fall I love it now for some reason like I just love the scent and I feel like the airy quality of these vibed so well so well and it just smells so good so this was like my a1 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 but pure seduction heat is very very good for the summer but this was like my love of a combo like this is so good i just love these two scents they're just airy but have that like raspberry this one has the strawberry nectar in it so i love a nectar juicy note it's so delicious so yeah that was combo number two to show you guys this one next this is so good for the summer so good bougie on a budget vibes like you guys know i have an affordable 
collection and I love my affordable collection that I got going on like I just be feeling like some of the combos I come up with I just be feeling like yes like um so this one is uh, a perfume here this is the J'adore perfume dupe from the it makes perfect sense brand so you can find this at like Walgreens CVS I've always mentioned these this is so spot on that I literally bought backups of this from CVS like it's so spot on like I literally mean like I smelled these and I fell in love but I literally smelled J'adore at Macy's one day just to make sure like this smelled as good as the J'adore and they literally smelled the exact same so if you guys ever come across this I would say get it it literally smells like J'adore I love it I'm gonna go ahead and spray this one out because I'm feeling it I'm feeling it oh my god you guys Jador is so lovely this combo hit before I even tell you guys I'm just gonna spray them all mm -hmm. It just was so good like it is so good like it smells like how do I describe this like it smells bougie on a budget like j'adore like it's like an aquatic scent but it's soft and feminine and it also has like a cleanliness laundry vibe about it but it's like floral and it's summery and it's sweet but it's pow not powdery but it, the aquaticness is like sharp in such a good way like it's so good so i have the j'adore dupe here i paired it with coco paradise and then i also added in the coco peach because your door actually has a peach note so this little baby popped into my head and the trio is just so good so good like this is like this is something right here this was phenomenal combo number three was hitting hard so the next combo that i have here is one that i've mentioned before it's the velvet petals heat and then topped with guest seductive noir this is so good like this is my my summer sexy like i already know what's going down like i know what the vibe is and I'm not saying like that, that, but like it has been that like vibe before. <laughs> um, this is so good. I don't know what it is about this combo in the summer, even though this one is like dark and like heavy and woody and it's perfect for like winter fall, but I don't know what it is when it gets paired with this velvet petals heat. She's sugared iris and golden amber. I don't know you guys it's just like it's like it's just incredible I just said the three little word but I'm not gonna add that in because I don't know like it's just it's beyond sexy like it just screams like a vixen I don't know like it's just so good it's so good so I've mentioned this one before and it was fire fire with the little mini white coconut caramel from bath and body works little mini white coconut caramel that was the combo these two and then that one i have it in here but I'm not gonna go get it i didn't use it recently with this recently i just paired it with a lotion and that's the vanilla and patchouli from the aromatherapy line from bath and body works it was so good it was so soft and just ready to go vibes like just ready to chill and just smell your feminine scent it's so so 
so good it, I don't know what it is it's like it's just a sugar amber woody vanilla and then the lotion the vanilla and patchouli is so comforting that's what it's called it's called comfort so mixed with this combo it's just so good i definitely wanted to go ahead and mention this combo again because this one was mentioned in a shower routine like layering video that i did so you guys i have a whole entire layering playlist that you should definitely go ahead and check out because my combos that i do are just so good and like i always say like i have an affordable collection so i'm definitely for like the affordable girls that like to layer i think i just have some good mentions like across the board that a lot of people have in their collections that you can actually use this one if you can get your hands on it in somehow some way this one is a banger Sure. i'll go ahead and mention this one i always throw like a super random one in that's just like it wasn't like fantastic but it was a layering combo that i enjoyed so i'm like super obsessed with like 60 degree weather like 55 60 degrees like i love a good sweater and i just keep mistaking like the fact that it's summertime now so i'll like pull for certain scents that i love like the pure seduction looks and everything like that but then i get outside and i'm like oh my god it's so hot it's like 77 and the bugs are like you smell so good like so this was definitely one of those combos i was like running around with my children and it was just too this mist was too heavy for the 70 like 7 78 degree weather but i still enjoyed the combo before i left the house this was the bombshell aisle but i mixed it with fallen bloom i just reached for fallen bloom for some reason like i reached for fallen bloom first and then i was just like i want to wear my bombshell aisle so i wore that and i just feel like something about it mixed with the plum really nice i'll probably pair this one with something different soon this was just a super random combo that i like my nose enjoyed for this the morning i have golden ocean pearl here i know that i do enjoy it with golden ocean pearl as well which is bergamot breeze vanilla orchid golden amber these are both like beachy aquatic scents i know that i already really enjoyed this combo if you didn't catch it in my review on the bombshell isle perfume um yeah this one is really nice as well this perfume is just stunning like this is like so good on its own the fragrance mist is back there it's so good like i would 100 percent recommend to get your hands on bombshell isle before it disappears in some way somehow another combo here that's not really summer but like it was summery for me like just if you go light-handed with the products and not heavy-handed so we do have the whipped coconut milkshake and this one is such a joy to have if you like layering it's ambery it's creamy the coconut is in there and that's like what like saves it and like makes it summery you can kind of get a vibe of like a super light caramel in there at least i feel like well maybe that's the vanilla ice cream it has vanilla ice cream toasted coconut and sugared amber it's it's really good it's really nice um so i did go ahead and pair this with the midnight amber glow body cream not too much though because this one has amber as well this one is smooth amber caramel latte and vanilla bourbon this one is for sure like fall winter vibes but i was using it for a bedtime scent if you just go light-handed you can get like that milky caramel vibe from it you know what i'm saying you don't want too much of the vanilla bourbon so yeah you definitely want to go light-handed with this one i feel like the caramelly like milky goes with the vanilla ice cream whipped milkshake vibe and i did top it off with a spritz of libre just a spritz this is the libre intense so the madagascar vanilla is gonna definitely like 
mix really really well with the caramel vibes that I got that I had going on yeah just a spritz just a tad I feel like the lavender in here is gonna mix with the toasted ambery scent of the whipped coconut milkshake um again like I said in the beginning like maybe not all these layering combos would appeal to everyone but they appealed to me and I wanted to share them just a spritz especially I really enjoyed it um I'm definitely gonna use this one again like this is definitely gonna be a nice nighttime summer combo when I want to pull out the like deep gourmand vibes I spent good money on this so it's like I gotta use it I gotta like spritz it here and there and not just specifically save it for like super important night outs or like super important like moments or specifically just for fall or winter or anything like it's definitely one you can layer definitely get in your collection layer and you'll realize like sometimes you just need one spritz of something and it just smells so incredible with your layering combo so yeah this one was definitely a hit as well you guys definitely a summer night vibe you're smelling milky creamy yummy vanilla ambery just good just good the last combo you guys bear with me because you know me i'm just layering everything but this one smells so so good like it's so good that i'm gonna be spinning it back so i do spend a lot of time at home so i can't say as to if like this would super hit in like the summer weather or the summer nighttime air because i wasn't able to test it that way but i enjoyed it for a bedtime scent for a yummy fruity vibe but also like i pull inspiration from other perfumes that i don't necessarily have in my collection so i started off with pink pineapple sunrise you want to top it with the rouge elixir from victoria's secret you guys oh my gosh so what we have here is like the C Passione perfume from Giorgio Armani, those types of vibes because that perfume has pineapple in it and then I always said that Rouge Elixir reminds me of that perfume for some reason. I think it's the red currant in this is smelling like the black currant in that perfume and this one is a little bit tricky for you know summer because it has the almond creme in there it's like so so good in fall it's so good but like i said sometimes you just need a certain amount of spritz of things and they just like really hit so the red currant was vibing with this sugary sweet pink pineapple palm sugar and sun drenched nectar so good and then i pair this perfume with literally everything the lavi Belle perfume this one has black currant, has like tonka bean in the base. I think it might even have pear. When you pair these three together, you guys, that's just it. You're sweet, you're delicious, you're feminine. This is such like a gorgeous summery combo. Like it's so good, so good, so good. So those were it, you guys. I won't talk your ear off any longer. I hope you guys enjoyed watching. I always enjoy talking about layering so i had fun i hope you guys had fun i will for sure see you guys in another video of mine don't forget to like comment and subscribe thank you again for watching